Yo, what's up guys, it's Zach. Welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about Alliance Tournament ship things. And there's a little bit of a, not a live commentary I would say, but a little bit of a discussion between me and Reload at the end. Where he actually traded his Raiju, which is the, the Gorma variant of the Alliance Tournament ships. Very expensive, uh, a lot of people are flying them. So he traded us to sit in, but man, like you won't believe what happened. I'll, I'll edit it all up anyway and you can watch that um later on but there's there'll probably just be some scrap video in the background here just while i update you on the whiptail thing so a few weeks ago well maybe a month or two ago i put the my alliance tournament ship up for sale uh for 250 billion on the market not the market the forum sorry and had a few bites here and there but ultimately we've now sold it thankfully i thought it was going to sell like instantly but because the raiju and the lelaps came out from the last alliance tournament which was very recent everyone's been just wanting to buy those right they haven't uh that's the new hot shit they're really really strong seen some videos from amelia actually flying them in uh, like more than one in fleet and stuff if i think on i'll put those videos in the description because like amelia's content's just like super like top tier pvp alliance tournament guys there so yeah definitely worth checking out but like i said that's pretty much the reason why my whiptail's taken so long to sell and i would, did a good deal with one of my friends um where it worked out like beneficial for both of us obviously because you know he gets the whiptail i get the shit on isk we'll we'll not uh, say how much but uh it was a lot so there's a lot coming in and if we just jump over to discord here you can see now this is all the video stuff I've had uh, going on pretty much since, when was that, the 1st, 24th of the 1st. So this is the end of January where we made this post and it's it gets like a little bit bigger. So these are the videos you can expect coming up. So mixing up the content, meta ships, all that sort of stuff. This is where all the ideas from you guys as well come into play. So you can uh, drop it in and I'll do my best to even put them in here because there's so much going on you know like events happen and that gets pushed forward and all that sort of stuff but with the all the isk that's coming in now we've definitely got enough to to like just start smashing out ships especially like the cinnable stuff because they're like mega expensive now and the, the red alu ships and pvp it's going to be like an expensive video right but i'll do my best to to make that like really really solid and uh, yeah just a, a ton of things in the works so yeah, back to the AT ships now. Um, like I say, Ray traded me his um, Raiju. So this is going to be like the live comms of what happens. And then after that, I'll probably just be the end of the video, guys, until the next one. So yeah, hope you enjoy the little bit of banter and discussion about the Raiju. And I will catch you next time. Uh, here you go. I can't say anything. Uh, I traded you. There you go. Didn't show any pictures, like. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, my inventory's taking here just to load here. Yeah. Just lost 150 bill, Lul. Well, I am literally recording as well, so if it does fuck up. Yeah, that's fine. We've got proof. Me, literally, my inventory's just spinning here, dude. What the fuck? What the hell? Uh, yeah, I guess reload then. Yeah, I'll try. Fuck's sake, dude. This is like not the time, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's everyone's worst nightmare. Just disconnect them while you're in an A2 ship outside. It's just... Mm. That's game over right there. Welcome back. There we go. Oh, buddy. Doesn't have a fit. <laughs> Still got nothing. It's got nothing on it right now. Still working oh, on the uh, epistles. It's fucking sick. It's like a. Does it, is it like shorter than the Gorma? Is it? It's like a. It's like it's like fatter. It's the best way yeah. to describe it. It's like a fat fat Gorma. It's like thick, isn't it? It's got. Oh, it's got the extra wings on, hasn't it? That's mm -hmm. why. Yeah. Makes it the look Lay Labs, actually... Lay, Lay Labs is the same. It has extra wings on it as well. Oh, it actually makes it does look thicker, doesn't that shit? Mm. So what's this one? So we got 20% bonus to warp scram and disruptor. That's pretty standard for them, isn't it? Um, it's the highest. It's the highest in the game. I don't. Not even Lichesis gets that. Oh shit! 
Oh no, I lie. It is. It's it's, just, it's the same mm -hmm. as the Jesus. Because this would be awesome, you know. Because like I fly my Gamma with like two dumps. <laughs> this would be fucking <laughs> epic for this, this dude. This would be the. Well, the thing is, it has better dumps than any recon in the game. Any yeah. EAS. You can get ninety percent dumps. You can dump a Hugin with a signal lamp to like one k. So it ain't gonna do anything to you. Ninety percent dumps, dude. 90, that... ninety. It's pretty crazy. Like when you think. Compared to like all the super old AT ships, like the even the Freckies and the Adestrias and shit, because like fun today's Eve, like the bonuses on those ships aren't like very good now, are they? Yeah, you can take a look at the Mimir and that, and it's literally worse than a, than the Munin. It's just Crazy, a worse version. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And back then, well, like AT8, so we're talking at least 13 years ago, that was the predator of the game. It's nice, aren't they? I love their gold, dude. Yeah, yeah, gold plated. As it should be. Oh, it's actually got black vents on the back. That's pretty nice. Damn, son. Alright, see you, mate. Alright, <laughs> see ya. <laughs> Alright, it's very nice. Sure, I've got some Merlins in this system.